so you guys asked for an unboxing video I've actually never done a, any sort of video before so pardon my lousy videoing skills so my setup for, for the Hobonichi this year is just a plain um, A5 cousin with a very boring black cover so initially I wanted to get something brighter something more colorful um, a, a cover this year but I couldn't find anything that I like for the A5 instead saw something that I really love on the A6 so I ended up getting just a, a couple of um, cover on covers um, actually quite a number of cover of co cover on covers for my cousin and then I caved in and got myself the A6 so um, let's look at what we have here Ta-da! The orange box! Nope, I did not actually keep my yellow boxes. I mean, I, I kept my yellow boxes from last year for quite a long time. But um, in the end, you know, my room is already very cluttered, which is why I'm unboxing this on my bed. And uh, I didn't really like the box. Like, um, it wasn't that easy to keep stuff in like the lid is it's kind of hard to open and stuff and I didn't I didn't keep it in the end like I threw it out after maybe half a year or something okay let's, I'm just gonna tear the paper so here we are um, two huge orange boxes in this one. Oh, my cover on covers so these are the cover on covers that I got for my cousin um, to spice things up this is um, this is really cute love them and this is the forest um, hide and seek in the forest or something yep this is farm and I really love this one because it has like um, the gold prints on it and this the red ball thing this one is really cute as well so yep um, cover on covers I got myself a small cute yellow jaw pouch um, I don't actually bring my stuff out to journal that often I don't know whether things will change with my new job but anyway I've been looking at the drawer pouches for a while and well decided to go for one uh, oh the freebie the not so scary bear and this is the cousin I got it as a single book it's um, pretty thick and heavy. I didn't want to get the Evac because um, I'm cheap. I wanted to save money and anyway, I don't carry out my cousin um, that much. It pretty much stays at home, which is why you see my this year's book is in a very nice condition because I don't actually bring it out much. So I decided to just get it as a single book. Another one because I got the A6 planner as well. Um, some cute papers, notebooks. Um, because I got the extra A6 planners, uh, more papers. Um, I got these two stamps because just because they were really cute. Uh, recently saw on Instagram photo on how people pasted washi tape inside the 
notebooks as like decoration and that looked really great so maybe I'll try that sometime um, more covers this would be for the A6 I guess oh and my geometric cover ho 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 so this was the one I fell in love with it's actually like fabric kind of where where's um let me try and open this where's on the website and the photos it kind of looked more plasticky from afar yeah, this will be the first time I, I'm getting um, a cloth cover so feels really good I think I'm going to enjoy myself using this and this is the plain A6 cover that I got to put to use with like blank notebooks and stuff hmm. oh I, I I thought the blue would actually be the same as my A6 blue but this is a, a darker blue compared to what I have this year what I have on my A6 so you can kind of see it's a different blue okay, let's look at the other box oh this is a nice there's a lot of covers yes I got some blank covers as well to go on the geometric cover okay mm. Accessories. I got myself the Hobonichi calendar. Um, not very sure if I'll actually use it much. It's a whiteboard thing and comes with a whiteboard marker. I also bought the Midori um, calendar after I ordered the Hobonichi one because the Midori one looked really nice. Um, so, well, I'll try my best to make full use of the items. Um, see, more notebooks. As well as, oh my god, this is tiny. This is the A6 planner. Also, as a single book, um, Japanese, I got the uh, um, Sunday start for this one. I was debating between Monday and Sunday start wasn't sure which is which one I'll prefer um, because the cousin is actually a Monday start I was thinking if I should keep you know everything the same but in the end for my calendars I'm used to having the Sunday start it just it just looks nicer because you have your like week centered in the middle and then you know Sunday here Saturday here it's just a thing that I got used to over the years because that's how I don't know, the US does it, but yeah, so for my calendars, I must have a Sunday start, whereas for the techo, I'm not really sure, so far I haven't been using my weekly or monthly pages, but yep, anyway, we'll see how things go next year, um, so what have I got here, yes! Pencil boards. I absolutely love the pencil board. I use it every day with my A6 planner. So um, I kind of went crazy and bought a ton of them in all sorts of different colors and styles. Well, three of every single size. Oh, this is the um, folder, pocket folder that fits the A6 size. Um, no, A5 size. I got one for the A6. This is for the weeks. Um, I was thinking maybe I could. I didn't buy a weeks planner, but I was thinking maybe I could use it for just my calligraphy stuff, or maybe if my TN notebook, although it's a bit small. But you know, TN they have a traveler's notebook. They have uh, their own pencil board, but I really dislike it. It feels horrible to write on. Same three designs for all my pencil boards. I didn't like the white with whatever strange characters one. 
so these are the A6 folders and uh, A6 pencil box as well as stickers can you see yep yeah so I, I really love more notebooks and a bunch of other other things um, bands decided to get a different color one for my A6 as uh, A5 as well um, I don't actually use the bands that much although I, I've been using it this few weeks um, some double sided tape thing the page marker which I don't really use but decided to get one anyway and some pocket stickers and stickers yep okay and bands and more stickers and that's all for my loot yeah but anyway back to the pencil boards I really really love them um, like when I do calligraphy and I'm using other notebooks sometimes I just want um, something to go underneath the paper because I'm using maybe brush pens or maybe even watercolor sometimes and I don't want the ink to go to the next page so that's when the pencil boards come in I have some other pencil boards from elsewhere but they are not as smooth or they are too hard and your pen just like glides over it really quickly and it, it just doesn't feel nice so I really love my Hobonichi pencil board so I bought a whole bunch of them tend to use it in my planner as well as elsewhere so yep that's all for my unbo unboxing video hope you enjoyed it and um, look forward to seeing your videos and your loots too see ya